Did you know that Brazil holds the record for being the last country in the Western Hemisphere to abolish slavery? It happened in 1888. Additionally, Brazil has a reputation of importing the highest number of African slaves compared to any other country in the Americas. This took place between the 1500s and 1850. Brazil is a country known for its vibrant and diverse cultural mosaic, and a significant part of this tapestry is woven by the African diaspora. Imagine a place where lively beats, captivating dances, and delicious flavors come together in an incredible blend of culture and history. Today, we're embarking on a fascinating journey to explore the intricate and often overlooked history and culture of Africans in Brazil. Join us as we go deep into the rich and complex history of Africans in Brazil, spanning centuries of resilience, creativity, and cultural influence. Before we continue, please like this video and subscribe to this channel. This really helps spread the word about these incredible places and inspires more people to travel and enjoy these amazing life experiences that they don't know about. The Arrival of Africans in Brazil In the early 16th century, when the Portuguese were really getting into colonizing Brazil, they started needing more and more labor. So they ended up relying heavily on enslaved Africans to meet that demand. The transatlantic slave trade was really intense back then. Can you believe those ships carrying thousands of Africans across the treacherous Atlantic Ocean? They were headed straight for the plantations and mines in Brazil. Did you know that Brazil ended up receiving the most enslaved Africans in the Americas over many centuries? These men, women, and children were forcefully taken away from their homes and cultures. They had to go through such unimaginable hardships during the dangerous journey called the Middle Passage. When these different African groups arrived in Brazil, they were all brought together, even though they had their own languages, traditions, and beliefs. Unfortunately, this forced merging created a new and oppressive situation for them. This chapter in history was really brutal, dark, and painful. But you know what? It's actually really important for us to understand the foundation of the Afro-Brazilian experience. Did you know that the African diaspora in Brazil had a huge impact on every aspect of Brazilian life? It influenced everything from the arts and religion to cuisine and language. Basically, it set the stage for a really big change in Brazil's culture. The Influence of African Religions it's really fascinating how the African diaspora in Brazil has left such a lasting impact on the preservation and evolution of African spiritual traditions. Candomblé, Umbanda, and Quimbanda are examples of interesting syncretic religions. They actually came about by blending African, indigenous, and European beliefs together. Candomblé is really impressive because it shows how African spirituality has endured over time. It's actually deeply rooted in the Yoruba and Fon traditions. It's all about worshiping Oryxas, the amazing divine spirits, and connecting with nature. Even though these traditions faced a lot of suppression during the colonial era and slavery, they managed to endure. People would often practice them in secret to avoid getting persecuted. Today, Candomblé is openly celebrated and it has a deep impact on Brazilian culture. Rituals are really cool because they involve rhythmic drumming, dance, and offerings to Oryxas. It's a special spiritual experience that brings together the past and the present. Have you heard of Umbanda? It's a really interesting religion that came about in the early 20th century. It's a mix of African, indigenous, and Christian beliefs. It's all about embracing a diverse group of spirits and really focusing on healing and communicating with the spirit world. However, Quimbanda is a mystical practice that incorporates African folk magic. These religious traditions not only provide spiritual guidance, but also serve as a powerful expression of African heritage. It's amazing how they've managed to thrive despite facing adversity. Brazilian Music and Dance Brazil's cultural scene is bursting with music and dance, but did you know a big part of this vibrant artistry actually comes from Africa? The African influence on Brazilian music and dance is absolutely incredible. It's had such a profound impact and has given rise to some of the most iconic cultural expressions that are recognized all around the world. Samba, with its irresistible rhythms and infectious energy, is a perfect example. It actually originated in the Afro-Brazilian communities. It's a beautiful fusion of various African musical styles like batuque and lundu, mixed with some European influences. But samba isn't the only Afro-Brazilian musical genre that captivates hearts and feet. Bossa Nova, born from samba and jazz, is another beloved style that's defined by its smooth melodies and intricate rhythms. 
It's enchanted the world with its elegant simplicity and distinctive harmonies. However, when it comes to dance, capoeira really stands out. Did you know that this incredible art form called capoeira was actually developed by enslaved Africans as a means of self-defense? It's truly amazing how it seamlessly blends martial arts, acrobatics, and dance together. As the forbidden dance of war evolved, it transformed into a captivating display of agility and grace. The African influence in Brazilian music and dance is absolutely incredible. It's like the heartbeat of the nation, captivating people from all around the world. Cuisine Brazil's culinary scene is truly amazing, with a rich blend of flavors and influences from Africa that make it so captivating. The food in this country is absolutely amazing. It's a fusion of African, indigenous, and Portuguese flavors that creates a one-of-a-kind culinary experience. There's this amazing dish called feijoada, which happens to be Brazil's beloved national dish. It's really something special. It's a black bean stew and is absolutely delicious. It's packed with different types of meats and spices, creating a wonderful fusion of flavor. It's a perfect example of how different culinary traditions can come together in one amazing dish. This dish is a delightful blend of African ingredients like black beans and okra combined with Portuguese sausages and spices. The result is a deliciously savory and rich flavor that people all around the country absolutely love. Have you heard of akarahe? It's an amazing street food that really captures the African influence. They're golden deep-fried balls of black-eyed pea dough. They're actually stuffed with shrimp and served with a vibrant chili sauce. Can you believe they originated in West Africa? Today, they're like a tasty representation of Afro-Brazilian culture, with their unique mix of textures and flavors. Afro-Brazilian cuisine is absolutely amazing. It takes your taste buds on a captivating journey with its spicy stews, tropical fruits, and bold seasonings. The flavors are so rich and complex, reflecting the diverse cultural landscape of Brazil that's nurtured them for centuries. Challenges and Achievements as we continue exploring the story of Africans in Brazil, it's important to recognize the difficulties they've encountered throughout their history. Slavery in Brazil was quite a significant and lasting issue. It had a much longer impact compared to many other countries. Yeah, it's really sad how the effects of this dark period still linger in Brazil. Systemic racism and inequality are still major issues that we're dealing with today. Can you believe how tough it must have been for so many people to make the journey from Africa to Brazil? It must have been really scary and difficult for them. It's really heartbreaking to think about what enslaved Africans went through. They were forced to endure such brutal conditions, ripped away from their homes, cultures, and families. The suffering they experienced during the transatlantic voyage is truly unimaginable. These challenges, along with the tough realities of life on Brazilian plantations, really left a deep impact on the Afro-Brazilian community. It's definitely a painful chapter in history that continues to affect them today. However, Afro-Brazilians have shown such incredible resilience and determination, even in the face of all these challenges. Over the years, they've really made some impressive progress in different areas, like politics, sports, music, and the arts. There are some really amazing figures in Afro-Brazilian history. Take Zumbi dos Palmaras, for example. He was the leader of Quilombo back in the 17th century. Those were settlements where escaped slaves would live. And then there's Pele, the soccer legend. He's a contemporary hero who really represents the strength and accomplishments of Afro-Brazilians. It's pretty inspiring, don't you think? And you know what? The fight for social justice is still going strong even today. Afro-Brazilians, along with their allies, are putting in a lot of effort to tackle the long-standing problem of racial inequality. They want to create a future where everyone is included and treated fairly. Celebrating Afro-Brazilian Culture Today, Brazil proudly celebrates its African heritage in numerous ways. A prominent example is the annual Carnival in Rio de Janeiro. This spectacular event not only dazzles with its vibrant costumes and samba beats, but also serves as a profound homage to the Afro-Brazilian culture. During Carnival, samba schools compete with elaborate floats, dances, and costumes, telling stories that often pay tribute to African deities and the struggles of the Afro-Brazilian community. The parade is a dazzling display of Afro-Brazilian culture, highlighting the richness of traditions, vibrant colors, and powerful rhythms that continue to shape Brazil's identity.
Throughout the year, festivals, religious ceremonies, and cultural events provide spaces to honor and share the enduring influence of Africa on Brazil's diverse and captivating cultural landscape. These celebrations bring people together, fostering a deeper understanding and appreciation of the Afro-Brazilian heritage that is a source of pride and inspiration for the entire nation. The African influence in Brazil is really amazing. It shows just how resilient, creative, and culturally rich the African diaspora really is. This story is truly incredible. It's all about survival, adaptation, and transformation. And it's had such a lasting impact on Brazilian society. As we're celebrating the amazing contributions of Africans in Brazil, it's really important to acknowledge that there are still ongoing struggles for social justice and equality. If we take the time to understand and appreciate this cultural tapestry, we can move towards a future that's more inclusive and fair for everyone. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more fascinating explorations of cultures around the world. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring the world's incredible diversity. See ya!